Hi guys, this will be my first movie about mining. I just bought two of the 6800 Radions. The same, it's just a different brand. Let's check what's inside. Well, the box is really heavy. I hope it's gonna be all right. Really nice packed. Over packaging as always. Let's be green. <laughs> Save environment. Let's pack in thousand boxes. Okay. Stop important driver information. Yeah, blah blah. Okay, so there she is. There he is. Here it is. Three fans. Massive card. Really. Weights like two kilos. Okay, now I'm afraid it's not gonna fit into my <laughs> tiny PC. All right, I have to make some modifications. <laughs> get back to you soon, sir. Okay, I managed to get the riser, but it requires one of the plugs. And from this tiny fellow, I have one for her here and the second one for here. And another surprise is I need two in here. So this one has to go. Okay, it's sorted. The new PSU, the 6800, all hooked up. I'm stubborn on this computer because I have windows on that. Okay, let's, let's see. Ooh. Ooh, I found one. Odd thing. Why there is a tip switch on the back of the graphic card? I'll have to read a bit about that. Ooh, that's nice. <laughs> okay, Windows started. Now they advise me to go to the web page to get the drivers. Okay. I've set it up. I even have the MSC afterburner to have a look. There's a thin read in the miner. But I'm getting strange things. Okay. Let's see, hold on. It's missing. Try to blah blah blah. Rec file. Okay. There's a thin read miner. And there's this rec file, which will erase your windows. <laughs> yeah, I want to. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's try again. Okay, cured. And your Windows is being deleted. <laughs> okay, let's have a look how it's gonna behave. Two second duck generation, it's. 10 times faster than on 570s. How's this looking? Okay, that's the first one. So we've got the normal operation without any overclock, 46. The power consumption, 180. Okay, so we have huge field of overclocking to, to do. This one spinning. <laughs> A bit hooked up. But this one is only for verifying its optimum parameters. Oh, it's going up, nice, without any overclocking. Okay, the afterburner gives me ability to tweak it undergoing. So let's go. Oh, I found some web page where they say it's 120 watts. Core undervolt 700 and memory clock plus 1000. So I'm gonna be applying that. It's a joke. Okay, I'll have to do it through other software. <laughs> 55 core clock. 
power limit. What, 6%? Kind of joke. Okay. 16, good. Alright, I'll play with it without the video and then I will return with the results. So far so good. <laughs> Don't change anything, but then there is the tuning complete. So, without anything else, 62.8. The same parameters. I'm not able to change those more drastically, so I'll have to do it through the other software. I have to first learn how to do it and then I'll come back. <laughs> the Timurid Miner is the best one for the AMD cards. And there is a Edhash tuning guide where you can find also this one. So, so this one's obsolete, should be alright. There is this automated tuning, blah blah blah. Ooh. Bloody hell. <laughs> I would love to have that. What the hell is that? <laughs> Two point. One terahash. <laughs> oh, no, they aren't so good. Oi. It's gone. <laughs> yeah, errors. And again, Python went to sixty two. Okay, I tweaked it a bit. Now it's 62.8, and they say in the manual 62. So this one's good. I've speed up the fan a bit, so the temperature is about 63. GPU, as those in the manual from the Team Read Miner. <laughs> it's running nice. Yeah. We'll squeeze 65 from this one. I hope they will ch they will vary between the manufacturers. Asus, this strange Merc 319. We'll see about that. Okay, guys. It's morning. The card is still running, and it's still consistently 62.8. That's great, and the power is 117. So this is cool too. The temperature is alright, these are the parameters, it's running. So good, there is still room for further optimization. Okay, I was trying to overclock it further, but it's impossible to put more than 150 and to decrease the power limit below that, so we have to go to other software to, to do that. There's an odd thing, it's without, it seems that without any uh, BIOS flashing it's impossible to go down with the voltage and with further with the megahertz of the memory and well I can decrease the GPU uh, frequency but nothing else, it doesn't affect the power, the hash rate is a bit different it, it varies a bit but it's it's nothing that that makes any difference really for the card operation lower gpu frequency lower the power uh, in this case ain't gonna make any difference the memory clock is maximum it's impossible to put anything more so that's it only flashing left. So this is the maximum. It's pretty okay though, anyway. Thanks for watching.